it, Scott. I want to go ahead and just quickly review a couple tips for torsions. And remember, when it comes to guys, a torsion is otherwise described as a twisted testicle. And from the guy's perspective, anything involving twisted and testicle is a bad combo. So with that in mind, why this is a huge deal is it's just like a heart attack. Remember, for countless years, if you're having the big one that they've taught that time is muscle. And in the last several years, there's been that huge focus on strokes when it comes to time is brain. But specifically when it comes to torsion, simply remember that time is testicles. And why this is a huge deal is if you look at the research, they'll show you that if you can find it and fix it, even within a couple hours, you actually have over 90% chance of saving the boys. However, if it flips to the other side, meaning it's been more than 8, 10, 12 hours since they actually had the torsion occur, then it completely flips the other way and you have less than a 10% chance of salvaging the testicle. So with that in mind, a little while back when I was playing in the ER, middle of the night, we had a teenage kid come in with a torsion. And urology popped by the ER to have a cup of coffee before they went upstairs to the OR. And they gave us a quick 30 second in service entitled, When Should You Wake Me Up at 2 o'clock in the morning? And this was actually kind of insightful from the guy that was about to go to surgery with this kid. And he said, number one, let's be honest, he said, you're probably not going to even call me until you've got an ultrasound that says you've got a possible torsion. He said, but outside of that, when do you think about torsions in kids? He said, simple. Number one, you've got a teenage kid who actually admits to having a problem down there. They said that's clue number one, because you're a 14-year-old little kid. The last thing in the world you ever want to admit is having a problem down there. He said, so number one, you actually man up and admit you got a problem down there. Number two, you hurt so bad, you barf. And if this teenage kid hurts so bad that they barf all over the triage nurse's shoes, he's like, get the ultrasound, wake me up, dollars to donuts, this kid has a torsion. So when it comes to MIs, time is muscle. When it comes to strokes, time is brain. And when it comes especially in teenage kids who've got trouble downstream, time is testicles. <laughs>